Uh, welcome back students. Uh, today we are going to understand very important use of uh, understanding certain words, the use of prepositions, very important use of prepositions or uh, avoiding the prepositions, whether prepositions will be used or not used, we will understand. So let's see, uh, there are four words. Uh, with these words, we don't use uh, prepositions while using them. So which prepositions are always avoided? Let's see, these verbs are understanding understanding the use of next last this and every today we will understand today we will understand the use of next last this and every and we will also understand which prepositions are always avoided uh, these with these which prepositions are always avoided with these they do not take at on and in they do not take at, on, and in prepositions. When we use these words in a sentence, then we can't use these prepositions. That is the main thing we are going to understand. For example, C is coming back C is coming back C is coming back next Sunday C is coming back next Sunday uh, so this is the correct use and if we say C is coming back on next Sunday, so this will go wrong. On can't be used with, we can say preposition can't be used with next. Next doesn't use preposition. Particularly this preposition that we frequently used with days. See another example. This is first example. See another example. He goes to home every Easter. He goes to home at every Easter. So this is wrong. Preposition is not used uh, before every and this is the correct one. See another example. He went to Manali last year he went to Manali last year so this is the correct one we can't say he went to Manali in last year okay this will be wrong we can't use this okay are you getting See another example. We will call you this afternoon. We will call you this afternoon. This is the correct uses. 
and see this one we will call you in this afternoon so this will be wrong so here we are understanding here we have actually understood that with these words next last this and every we don't use any preposition if we are using the preposition frequently these prepositions are used frequently these prepositions are used in such type of sentences when some day is mentioned when some year is mentioned when some particular time of the day is mentioned then we frequently use these prepositions but we don't have to use these prepositions with these words so with this i think you have understood this and with this the class time gets over and we will understand uh, the uses of more such words uh, they may be any part of a speech but we must know their correct um, uses in the sentences so that we are able to communicate ourselves our ideas in an effective way so before i end uh, let me remind you if you have not subscribed the channel you may subscribe and if you have already subscribed then you may recommend the channel to your friends you may uh, like share and comment you can give your comment also in the box um, regarding the quality and content of the um, this uh, these classes or the videos so thanks for watching and keep watching